so much for jumping on. My next video, uh, she is absolutely gorgeous. Um, a little insight of how we met is my website and my YouTube, and I am so happy that I got to meet her. She's seriously, she doesn't talk too, too much in the video, but her accent, you guys, unbelievable. Absolutely adorable. She's so cute. Her personality and this haircut just suits her style. Like she's just fun and spunky. And anyway, I love the cut. So go ahead and watch it. Let me know what you think. Um, it's fun. Her husband dropped her off um, to the salon and then he comes back and he ended up he ended up saying that he was coming back with her next time. So anyway, they had texted me and, and she's loving it and excited about compliments. And so I'm really, really excited about this haircut for you guys to see. And I know I always say really excited, but I am always excited about hair because I'm obsessed. But anyway, I appreciate you guys' support. I hope you guys have a phenomenal day and I'll talk to you soon. See ya. Hi everyone, this is Pauline. And yes, absolutely, she's gorgeous, right? First off, but her personality and anyway, her heart's just as sweet as she is, I can just tell. So um, the few minutes that we've been like talking in person, this is my first time meeting her. We've been talking, obviously, she found me through the website, but um, it's just so fun to meet her and she, uh, she's just darling. And I'm really excited to show the haircut that we're going to do on her. Um, it's going to be fun, short, spiky, spunky up here, and then short back here. We're going to leave the, the side longer, and anyway, it's going to be really fun, and she is really going to um, look really good with this cut. Hi. Yeah. We're, we're videotaping your wife now, right. so anyway, her, her husband just watched us, so we're saying you. hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we are going to come here in the back. Just gonna cut straight across here. And then I'm, I'm gonna trim the bottom up with the trimmers. Just clean that up. And she, the texture of her hair is fine, but she has a lot of it. Um, and you'll notice when I blow dry her how gorgeous it is. You'll really be able to see. Okay, so this we are going to take um, down. We're going to have it, well, I'll show you that in a minute. Okay, so we're going to hold this up. We're going to cut down into here. We're just going to have this short and fun and messy, which is, I mean, just her little personality is so stinking cute. So this cut is going to be great on her. Now back here, she has a calic, um, which with this style is actually going to help out. Um, I'm going to really texture through this area just so it will stand up so it doesn't plop forward because she has a, a hard time with that area. So the texture will help with that. Okay, so that top, after I cut it like that, then I'm gonna come uh, tight down um, through this nape area, just because it's gonna be less for her to have to mess with. And easy's good, right? Yeah. You like easy hair? Yep. And her husband just retired, so now they can, she can have easy hair and they can go do whatever, whenever, right? <laughs> Not waiting on the wife. Or that's what I always hear. <laughs> Not just with you. I'm not saying that. <laughs> just with everyone, you know. Can't wait for the wife to get ready. Okay, so you can see that I'm just chopping into that top. And I always say chopping. I guess I shouldn't use that word. I really, I'm just point cutting into that. Uh, the more movement you have with this haircut, uh, the better off you'll be. It'll style easier. 
the more movement you have. Okay, and then this side, same thing. Just gonna point cut into that. And then of course with, with her hair being fine and she has a, a lot of it, um, the texture is really important, especially with this cute cut we're gonna do. Okay, we're gonna leave this side long. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold this out and I'm gonna point cut into it. I'm just not gonna go as short Okay, you can see I'm just holding that out a tiny bit. And then I'm just gonna come up and connect with this other area right here. Okay, so by her ear, this is where it's gonna be, be longer. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna connect a little bit right here just so this isn't so, so long back here, because we don't want her to have to deal with that. And then you can see I'm just gonna angle that down by her ear. There we go. All right, Pauline, you doing okay? I'm fine, thanks. Okay, you're welcome. Um, I, here in a second, I'm really going to get her talking because her accent is amazing. <laughs> and she probably doesn't want me to say that on there. But seriously, her cute little voice is, is adorable. Okay. So I just kind of went back through that area to double check that. Okay. Now, we're going to come up to this front. Say, hey, how are you today? <laughs> Smashing. Oh, <you're> so <laughs> See, oh, you should hear her. She's darling. Okay, um, now what we're going to do is take this. We're going to kind of come up on an angle a little bit. What I mean is just kind of come up to this bang area. Just so that kind of falls with that. So you can see when I lift that up, I'm coming up to that front vein. And we will take those a little shorter um, and texturize those also, but in a minute. Okay, now by the ear, we're gonna hold this out. And like I said, we're gonna leave it longer. So I'm just kind of point cutting into the ends of this just so it stays healthy, but we're not taking a lot of length. Okay, same here. We're just going to take a little bit off of the sides. Then, of course, we will definitely texture it. Then that way it won't feel like bulky on the side. Gonna angle, you can see that. Just gonna come this way. Okay, perfect. And now for, for this side, um, we want length over her ear here, but I'm gonna take it tight up through this area. Same thing here, just gonna keep this tight. And actually, Pauline, your uh, calic right here is gonna help that stand up. <laughs> so yeah. you'll like that. Yes, I will. 
So you guys can see I'm taking quite a bit off of here uh, because we want it really noticeable, the one side short, asymmetrical, and the other side longer. Okay, same for this area in the bottom. Just staying close to her nape area. And, oh, there's my phone going off. <laughs> okay. So, I'm just leaving this a little bit longer over the ear, so I'm not taking the length off there. And I'm just gonna hold this out, take a tiny bit through this area. Okay, a little bit more through this area too. We don't want it too long. kind of checking this out she doesn't want a part you know we're just going to kind of have all this up you doing okay doing good thanks okay <laughs> good deal So you can see I'm just taking uh, different lengths, if you can see that. We want different lengths just for that movement. Okay, now I'm going to come in, just kind of piece out these bangs. <laughs> Sorry, you feel like that hair right in your eyes. <laughs> Then I'm just gonna come on the angle, and I'll come this way so you guys can see, sorry. Just gonna piece this out. Which the way I like to do that is cut a little bit, and then skip a little bit. Come in, cut, skip, cut. That just gives different lengths in there. That makes it look wispy and light. Not so heavy. Try not to get that in your eyes. <laughs> and then I kind of start up from here and go down. Okay, hopefully that's <laughs> out of your eyes. Sorry. <laughs> Is that okay? A little bit of hair in your eyes. Okay. All right. Now, okay. Texturizing shears, best friend on this haircut. Okay. You're going to come in. You're going to come up about a half inch into this area all the way through it. Like I said, she has fine hair, but she has a lot of it. Um, but with this cut, you're going to want a lot of texture. That's going to help this cut stand up and have a lot of movement. So you can see I'm just coming through the sides here also and through her front. Okay. And of course, the front here a little and her sides. So that side doesn't feel... Um, too bulky but it's still long but it has movement in there so it's not just one solid chunk on the side okay and then you can just okay what I'm gonna do really fast my dear is get this off your face there we go <laughs> okay now I'm gonna see if it's 
So you can see, you guys, if you do this and it stands up, that means there's enough texture. If not, you're gonna wanna go through and texture a little bit more. Okay, that's standing up good. A little bit more back through this area, okay? All right, now the fun part begins. <laughs> the, the root lifter, that's what's gonna help her hair stand up. Just spray that through the top, wherever you want volume. Just one squirt of mousse. You just rub this in real good. It's very concentrated. Don't do more than one squirt or you're gonna fill it. One is plenty. Okay, perfect. Now, the key to um, drying a fun haircut like this is movement, okay? So whatever you do, don't just sit and dry it like this in one spot. You're gonna wanna move your fingers back and forth. And then here in a minute, we'll use the Epic Wet Brush. That will really help, which is so fun because Pauline already bought one. <laughs> So she's good to go, she has it. Now she just gets to use it. Okay, so now, Pauline, what I'm doing is I'm just going opposite way, uh, you know, the way you really want it, just for a little bit of volume. And then back this way. Okay, then when you get it to about, I don't know, 80% dry, in fact, I'm going to spray that a tiny bit because I'm going to bring this down a tiny bit this way, like the front part of it. Oh yeah, so did you feel how dry it was? Okay, perfect. Okay, then, then she's just going to go back and forth. Look that, sweetie. Oh, feels good, yeah. A little bit of a massage while you get your hair done for the day. <laughs> then you just kind of come forward. I mean, you guys tell me. Now, she's gorgeous, right? Like, yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, so now, that's what I love is, you know, she wanted a little bit longer over her ear like I like mine, and just going to come through here, and I'm just keeping that length, I'm just um, piecing it out a tiny bit, so it's not cut totally straight. Okay, so cute. All right, now two drops of oil, um, add shine. It'll also um, condition it while it's in there. Won't weigh it down. I'm excited to turn her to the mirror pretty soon. Show her the end. Okay, this is the clay. I just take a little Fingertip of that, rub it in good in my hands. And then you just kind of grab at it, just grab and pull. And then you can just kind of place it where you want it. That's good. <laughs> yes, exactly, that is good, huh? Just say, hey, go here, and it should go there. <laughs> Especially, um, I've had a lot of people tell me they can't achieve you know, the pieciness and the fullness, the key is definitely a lot of texture. That's, that's really huge. Um, and then of course the right product to get it to look the way that you want it. Okay, now I'm gonna turn her to the front. I'm not quite done with her, but I do need to turn her to the front to see. 
What do you think? I love it. Do, do you? I Yay! Do. Yes. Oh, good. I'm so excited. It totally fits you. Like, you're gorgeous. You're, oh, I just love it. Um, now, it's how does cheeky. that, what's that? It's a cheeky cut. See? See? Yes, that's a good word. I love it. Um, I love that. I love, love, love that. Okay, do your bangs feel too long? Are they okay? They feel about right? Yeah, they're good. Okay, perfect. All right, now I'm just going to take the hairspray, which will hold, but it won't feel sticky. That's the other thing, this clay. Like, it looks like it's really pieced out, but it's not sticky and, like, solid, you know? Um, and that's what I use in place of distortion is the clay. And also the Epic Wet Brush. There's links below that you can get that also. Okay, I'm gonna turn her one more time. Oh my gosh. You are like, so oh, cute. Good. Oh, I'm so glad. All okay. Right. All right, awesome. She loves it. Okay, I'm gonna turn her around so you can see the whole. What about the hubby? Does the hubby That's like good, it? good, yeah. Oh, good, see, I passed. Whew. Just kidding. All right, um, Pauline, thank you so much for taking time to come down and let me cut your hair. So fun to get to know her, and I'm glad you guys got to see her gorgeous face and her fun cut. So um, again, thanks for all your support. Uh, go ahead and jump on my email list. It's at the bottom. Go ahead and click, and you can be a part of all my deals and my tips and tricks. Have a good day, you guys. See ya.